On a bright Saturday afternoon, we drive to the bombers of Nakuru, located at Mailitisa along Nakuru Nyahururu Road. Close to the entrance, we come across a cage containing group of ostriches, guinea fowls, and quails that struggle to put their beaks through the wire mesh, offering a wide interaction for visitors. Ostrich, he type ni na ito masai ostrich. Tuko na tato, tuko na bili, eh, ah, two hands, I mean, na one man, ama one cock. Easy, tuko na twenty bili months, tuko almost kufisha mashuli tu na kwenye mashuli tu ya two years. Kwa watu zimeanza kuhusu na. Signs are on heat. Moving further into the facility is a traditional bridge that ushers us into the traditional village and under it is a pod that is used to rear tilapia and catfish. The path leads us to the traditional village which contains 10 homesteads representing the various Kenyan communities that saw him spend 1.7 million shillings to put up. The various home settings clearly portray the communal number of huts that every community considers to be a complete homestead. Uh, as you can see, the village, kuna different communities. Kenza pala chini kuna kikuyu, juu kuna masai, kirudi chini ten then kuna embu, kuna miji kenda, kuna kisi, kuna lui hapa, kuna teso, kuna kamba. Hapa tumesimama hapa ni kualuo, then kuna, kuna kalejin. So hizo village zote, zina represent 10 different tribes. The pod contains five crocodiles that can be seen from the edges of the pod with the springs of the underground water channeled into it. The facility is also popular with the students carrying out research on various cultures and indigenous plants from primary, secondary and university level. <laughs> So bad temperatures are my eye, come on, it's the poor.